no puedo. Hey, boy. It's me. Wondered when you'd roll back in. Come on, girl. ain't that bad. Things is fine. Fine. Almost dandy. Unlike most of you whiners, I've been in some real tight spots. And this ain't even a goddamn spot, let alone a tight one. I felt rope around my neck more than once. Don't scare me. This don't scare me neither. Not one little What? It's okay, I'm just needling you. At least not to them that's gonna quit moaning. Stay away, Morgan. I see straight through you, Micah. This is the wrong time, Morgan. You might have Dutch fooled. What's really the problem, Arthur? Huh? Not me. You're rattling the wrong cage. You all right? Are you all right? Strauss is gone. It was time. Okay. Guess I'll leave you to it then. We'll just soldier on this. I think you did the right thing with Herr Strauss. It was time. Thank you. Well, try to keep your head straight. Be well.
out. Now where'd be the fun in that? Come on! Hey! What are you looking at? Mr. Morgan. You still here, kid? Yes. Mama... Mama can't leave. It won't leave. I, I don't know. I said I had the money. It, she said your money weren't moral. She said it'd be better to die than to take it. <laughs> Maybe she's right. I don't know. I don't know anything about morals. She's still heading out. Working, you know? I'm sorry, son. <gasps> sorry about all of this. She ain't been back for a few hours. She left with some fella down the railway tracks. I did not like the look of him. Which way, you say? Uh, that way. Around the woods, towards uh, Willard's Rest. I'll see what I can do. Not. Well, that's enough now, partner. Oh, no. You're starting to scare me, let alone the poor woman. Clear off. Who are you? Someone who don't want to hear no more of your nasty mouth. Push me. I'll put a bullet in you. I, I presume Archie sent you? I said clear off before I deal with you. I'll see you again, dearie. <sighs> Listen. Listen to me. <coughs> Excuse me. You sound like my husband. I know. Listen, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what happened. I was uh, a fool. And I'm suffering for my foolishness. But don't go and get yourself killed because of your pride. You have a son, Mrs. Downs. I'm just so ashamed. Ashamed? <laughs> of what? <laughs> you loved him. <laughs> you did everything for him. <laughs> Let's get you home. Let's go. Boy. 
Yep. Help. I'm sorry it had to come to this. Stop saying sorry. Sorry won't bring Thomas back. I know. <laughs> so you're sick now, too? And you think that affords you the opportunity for penance for cutting his time short? No. I ain't looking for that. Okay, then. So just forget about me and the guilt you're carrying, because no good can come of that for either of us. And all you can do now is decide the man you want to be for the time you have left. Help someone who can still be helped. Why help yourself? I suppose you're right. Oh, hang yourself for all I care. You're right to dislike me. Archie should be waiting for us just up ahead. someplace else. Start over. Here, take this. I don't need it no more. I don't want your money. Yeah, I know you don't want it. I don't. You sure as shit need it. Take it. No. I ain't looking for forgiveness. It ain't about that. But don't forgive me. Just take the money and get out of here. Please. I know I ruined your life. I suffer for it every day. But don't let yourself get killed for, for pride. I've seen it kill too many folk. Don't say anything. Don't thank me. Just take the money and pack your bags. That's all I gotta say. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. I said don't thank me. Get out of here. Please. Tell my friend here about how I nearly died out there one night. Ooh, sounds like quite a tale. Here's an idea. Gunsmith's a friend. Pick out what you want, and I'll pick up the tab. Mm -hmm. It's Jenkins. Ooh, yes indeed. Anything for you, buddy. Anything. You are nothing if not generous. That's kind of you. Thanks. You're very welcome, friend. All the best. Well, he did save my life after all. I probably would have gotten it open, but I said it so right. It really got me. Uh, you taking credit for the quality of the trap? I'm just saying that it, the word there it got trapped in it. It was gonna trap real good. Yeah, but you trapped your own hey, mister. self instead, did Good morning, you? mister. No, I sure hope it don't Must be tough to for you so. staying awake sometimes. Huh. Fair enough. Well, I got a mosey. Anyway, I won't distract I you. Will. I will. Bye for now. Hey there! Good morning, mister. Hey, mister. You behave yourself this time. You know what's good for you. So, you're the muscle around here. I don't think you know what you're Hi there, saying, mister. mister. What are you up to? Try that again, tough guy. Hello. Stop messing with me. Hey there, partner. Good morning. 
You sure run into some nice folks out this way. Oh, yeah? Howdy. Hey, who the hell are you? Just get, now! You got a problem, pal? What'd you say to me? What, you, you wanna start some? Let's see about this. You want me to kill you where you stand? Come on! Oh, 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 man. Shit!
fella. You ain't welcome in these parts. The Murphys remember what you did to them. Please, Murphy. Always will be. He shoots like a girl. I really can't. I must come. He's my husband. I insist. Insist all you like. Ain't happening. Arthur Taylor. Tell her what. She ain't coming with us to collect her husband. I... Abigail, you ain't coming. That's the end of the matter. See, there you heard him. Now let's go. 
But... But nothing! It'll be quicker and easier with just the two of us. Plus, John will be calmer without worrying about you. Ain't complicated. Well, well, I ain't the crying sort, but I'm real grateful. Yeah, we know you are. We'll bring him back to you. Thank you! Thank you both! Alright, here goes nothing. The place is surrounded by marshland. Should hopefully give us a bit of cover to move in close enough to find a spot and look for John. This time of day, prisoners will probably be working the fields. Then all we gotta do is take out all the guards and row our way out of there. Seems simple enough. Uh, how many times, Marston? I think I see him. There's a group in front of that bar, just to our right. Oh, uh, yeah. I see two guards. Okay, take them out, and let's go get our boy. Okay. Hey, you're in the way. Go over there and see. Okay, come on. Ah! I thought one of those guards was still moving. Come on, Arthur. Let's keep moving. Where is he? You see him? No. You, mister, you know John Marsden? I, he ain't, he ain't working today. Put the gun down, lady. No, you put the gun down. Now. Where's John Marsden? Uh, uh, he ain't in the work detail today. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we'll go and get him together. <laughs> Try anything, I'll blow your damn head off. You clear on that? Yes, very clear. Oh, no, you don't. Come on, partner. <clears throat> hey, why don't you apologize <clears throat> to the lady for pointing a gun at her? Excuse me? I said apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry, ma'am. Ain't no harm done. So, where do we go? Towards the entrance, I guess. And who's in charge of this fine establishment? Jameson, sir. Jameson who? No, Mr. Jameson. Eston Jameson. 
Uh, being nice, fella? Uh, he's been quite an exacting boss at times. I look forward to meeting him. They're... they're not gonna let you do this. Well, that's gonna be up to you, my friend. So, you a popular employee, my friend? Not especially. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Someone in there actually gives a damn about this fool. Guess we'll see. We're gonna have to shoot our way out of here regardless. Hold your fire! Faster. <laughs> okay, friend, be cool now. Just do as I say. Drop the goddamn gun! Is Jameson in? He's in San Denis. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston. Right now. You got one minute. I'm counting. One, two, three. Um, uh, Milliken, uh, is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four? Oh, or so? very funny. No, we must be at eleven by now. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Faster. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Now, hurry up! Well, this poor fool's gonna get his brain shot out. And over what? For nothing. Hey, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. Hurry up and bring that asshole out here, you bastards. Come on. Don't cry, buddy. I don't want to die. Yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John. Oh, you too? Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Medican here will stop crying once and for all. Okay, today's your lucky day. Let's go! <laughs>
Seems to need rescue at first. Uh, nice to see you, Arthur. Uh, there's some fellas coming here. Don't look too friendly. We best get out of here. Come on, boys. Let's move. I'll row. You shoot. Seriously? Let me. You, you're a better shot. All right, fine. You just relax and enjoy yourself, John. Leave the real work to them as can still handle it. Thanks. Ah! <laughs> I think I liked you better when you was all trussed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. Oh, hurry up. They're gonna be on our tails soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told them. Ugh. Hey, Arthur. Thank you. Don't mention it. Let's go. We should get out of here quick before the law gets wind of this. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? She's fine. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got Hosea. Hosea? That still don't seem real somehow. All them years. Arthur. He was like... Like family. Yeah, we lost young Lenny too. No. What a goddamn mess. And then we... What about the, the money? Lost somewhere at the bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. The only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm, and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba? Wait. You're gonna have to tell me all of this again. It's a long story, but things ain't been good, John. <laughs> You're telling me. We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Roanoke Ridge, and some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah, seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead, too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And... Uh... I should warn you, Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so... Might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. Dutch ain't himself right now. Or maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his favorite no more. <laughs> Guess not. I told you we would. John! What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I went. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yes. And? When Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. 
Loyalty. Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John! John. You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. Thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Oh. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. Okay, Abigail. Okay, say no more. Well, you missed the best part. Tough times, Mr. Morgan. I should. Hey, Charles. Where's Arthur. Kim? Thanks Where's for sticking Kim? with us. Of course. Hi, Tilly. Arthur. Time for Strauss to go. Well, hang in there. All right, Arthur. Yep. Hi, Bill. Morgan. Hey, boy.
Hamish. Arthur. Well, come in. You said we might go out fishing. Don't take much persuading to get me to go fishing. Let's go in my boat. Good. Here she is. You mind rowing? Sure. What are we fishing for? Yeah. Only one thing worth catching in this lake. The great tyrant. Oh. <laughs> mean as hell, Northern Pike. Uh. Eats everything else that spawns around here, its own kind included. Well. Is that our bait then? A jack or something? Hell no. He's a clever old bastard. <laughs> I made these. This one's mine. You're gonna have to spare. They are pretty. You don't know the half of it. <laughs> Come on, let's push off. I'll show you where we're rowing to. <sighs> Take us over there to the right. We'll set up ten yards or so offshore. You don't keep far away from me, the tyrant. Wants me to know whose lake it is. We'll show him who's boss. <laughs> the optimism of youth. Right here. We'll cast off towards the island. Okay. You got that lure I gave you? Get her out. Spent years working on that. Finding the right combination of feathers, twine, and glimmer. Making them, losing them, getting them right. I tried coins, shell casings, even a metal. Finally found something he seems to like. And now I hear you can buy him in a shop. Well, it wouldn't be quite so satisfying. Getting him with something shop bought. Easy for you to say. <laughs> but maybe I'm inclined to agree. Got something? Ah, I got something, all right. <laughs> uh, hey, him. Hey, you need Come on a... now, Tyrant. I got you. I got you. Come on. <laughs> ah, <sighs> ah, went all slack. Went all slack. Come back. Oh, it's a drop back. Uh -huh. Hamish! Amos! God damn! He's 
bigger than I remember. Stay there. I'm throwing out to you. Real quick. Bastard just bumped me. Hey, come on up here. You lost anything? It's just my rod. We got my toes, too. They weren't wooden. If you want another go at him, I still got my lure. Nah. He's your fish now. Cast away. We'll come at him from the other way. Row over there. When he bumped me, I had to check twice. Thought I'd find a chunk of me missing. Man eating pie? That would be a first. I'm not so sure. Okay, right here. Our hopes of catching this bastard lie with you. Cash back to where we were, and make sure to use that lure I gave you. Just a bit faster now. I think... I think I hooked him. Real. Let's land the bastard. Time to reel. Don't let him pull you. Sorry for. You caught him. Let's row back. Here, here. Oh, the holder. <sighs> Pass me the tyrant. That is if you're sure you don't want him. <laughs> oh, I ain't gonna poach from your pond. <sighs> well, I'll give him his honors then. He sure was something, huh? <sighs> he was. <clears throat> Thanks for taking me out. I appreciate the company. <sighs> That's one hell of a fish. Ain't he something? <laughs> so long. Hey, you ever want to go out hunting? You stop by again. I may. Time to go, boy. <laughs> <laughs> 